Are you sure you know how to get there? It feels like we've been walking for hours. It shouldn't be too much longer. I see a campsite over there. Let's go set up camp. Let's tell scary stories. Well, not too scary. Do you know the story of the Poison Lake? Ooh, I love that one. You start. Well, not so long ago, in a forest, much like this one, there were imps and kelpies living as happily as could be. Imps, as you all know, are tiny and mischievous. Let's be mischievous. <laughs> That's stuck. I will get pay my souls. <sighs> Come on, let's go play the beach. But one imp was a little bit different than the rest. Don't forget about her. She'll be back. And the forest had more than just imps. In the middle of the forest was a large lake, which was filled with all sorts of creatures. Like fish and eels and crabs and kelpies. Kelpies look like horses, but they are much, much more dangerous. They lure you to shore and can pull you underwater. But not all Kelpies are mean. What about sponge shrimp? I was getting to that. One day on the beach where the forest meets the lake, an unusual imp and a unique Kelpie met. Hi, I'm Spider. Hi, I sponge. Do you want to have a splash fight? I know it. Ding, ding, whatever. Oh, I, I'm not pretty well. You didn't look too well. You're starting to change color. Look over there. As Spider and Shrimp looked around, they could see all the other creatures starting to look sick. Spider, <laughs> you have to do something. What can I do? I think there's something wrong with the water. I heard there was a magic map spirit on a faraway shore. Maybe if you find the spirit, it'll help us. You have to come with me. Me? I don't know. You know, I'll be. Okay. Yeah, I'll try. So Sponge and Shrimp set off across the sea in a sailboat. The journey was long. And so to pass the time, they sang a little song. What do you do when the water's poison? What do you do when the water's poison? What do you do when the water's poison? In the desert forest. Hey, hey, up she rises. Hey, hey, up she rises. Hey, hey, up she rises early in the morning. Their journey was long and hard. Do you think that's the shore over there? I think. That would be. I, I can't. Try for my spoiler. Hey, let's go up anchor William to the beach. They had finally made it to the other shore. Now where should they look for the map? Let's dig and see if we can find it. They dug to the left, they dug to the right, they dug really close together, and they dug very far apart from each other. And just when they were about to give up, suddenly... Uh 
found something. What? What? I bet the map is in the side. Where? The key. And at that exact moment, they heard something in the tree above. Something that sounded like a bird, but no bird they had ever heard before. Squawk! 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 That's kind of the tree. Mainly the bird and the key. surprising to see you in my tree, Toots. Do you want to hear a joke? I actually think we need... Knock, knock. Who's there? Money. Money who? I hope you got money to pay me. <laughs> we don't have any money. Can you please help us with... Knock, knock. Who's there? Sand. And who? Sand all over your face. <laughs> Where were I really? I'm on time alert. The knock. He's uh, Who's there? Money. Money who? Money over your face. And just when it seemed like all hope was lost, that they would never be able to open the box, or find the magic map spirit, or heal the sick creatures, you please help us. I found the little box. You can't. The funny key. The key? Well, of course. Here it is. Why didn't you say you needed it? Duh. Give up the jokes. So they climbed back down the tree and onto the beach and put in the key. They opened the box, they saw the map, and the spirit came out of the box. Please, can you help us? Oh, water is possible. And you want to sit. You want to do. Hey, hey. Hey. I don't think we can do that. That's not a good idea. you. Uh, you know of uh, all. Uh, <laughs> I guess this was a mistake. There's no answer here. They were so discouraged. Did we come all this way? To all this stuff? For nothing? Nothing else. You, you kill her. That is really true. Hmm. I 
think it's time for us to free up. No! Yes, it's we. It grow as always. You had first chance, a first thing, an answer. I'm gonna fly into the air and look for an answer there. I can take this boat and sail to another island. I will stay here. It is there. Give me there another map. So the imps and the Kelpie split ways. They weren't going to solve this problem together. Their best bet was doing it on their own. And some say if you listen closely at night, you can still hear them singing their traveling song. But they never saw each other again. 